is our sports producer, Sean Cunningham, with his standard trademark hat here. Uh, he's been busy over this last couple of days. Uh, it's been eventful since the Kings closed out their season on Wednesday. He broke the news that took over the NBA Twitter timelines yesterday. Former Lakers head coach Luke Walton is expected to be the Kings' new head coach. I like to say we've been busy. We've been busy. We've been busy. I've yeah. just been relaying the information. <laughs> He's been out gathering it. A formal announcement should be coming in a couple days. Yeah, I mean, uh, maybe as early as tomorrow. Uh, but the whether the timeline, whatever the timeline is, Luke Walton will be the next head coach of the Sacramento Kings. And purple and gray and black should probably look good on him. Yeah, he wore yeah. purple for a while, a little while in his yeah. last gig. This would be his second head coaching job. Of course, he was relieved of his duties as the Lakers head coach just a couple days ago and right after he was the front runner to take Dave Yeager's job after he was fired on Thursday. Three losing seasons in L.A. It's been three losing seasons here under Dave Yeager in Sacramento. But this is the guy that, according to sources, say that Vladi Divac wanted in 2016 before he even brought on Dave Yeager. Yeah, and if people remember that long coaching search, it took almost a month. And Luke didn't have the Kings on his radar because he was laser focused on LA. Mm -hmm. Vladi would, really would have loved to have had Luke Walton, as would a lot of teams at that point. Sure. Mm -hmm. And I think Vladi Divas was literally just kind of sitting back, rubbing his hands together, waiting for his guy to become available. But of course, before he was head coach of the Lakers, he was an assistant under Warriors head coach Steve Kerr. He took over for Steve Kerr when he was recovering from back surgery during the 2015-2016 season. And you made the trip out to Oakland before their playoff game, and uh, we got to hear from Steve Kerr, who had high praise for Luke Walton. Well, I'm happy for Luke. Um, sad for Dave Yeager. I think Dave um, has done a fantastic job there the last few years, and he really helped establish a great foundation that Luke's going to inherit. He's an incredible basketball mind. He's a wonderful human being. And he's got the right temperament uh, to not only coach a team, but to get along with management. Uh, and he's the guy you want to go to battle with. That Kings team is really impressive and exciting, and uh, I love their future, and uh, I think they got the right coach for, for the job. So you heard it there. We have much more sound from last night's playoff game on our ABC10 YouTube channel and on our website. but. I mean, you got a championship coach saying you got the guy you want here in Sacramento. That's a guy who spent two years with Luke Walton. Look, the one thing that's undeniable is the fact that he's going to play fast. We've seen that. He's yes. been able to work well with a young team. But can that drama stay behind and can he usher in a new era with expectations of the playoffs? That remains to be seen. So mm -hmm. that's the major question mark, and I can't wait to hear from the guy.